Hi, I'm Richard. In our previous videos, we gave you a product overview and helped you get set up in Sage One Accounting. Now, we'll show you how to process a customer invoice. Processing an invoice is simple using Sage One Accounting. As I've said before, we aggregate all tasks and features of Sage One in their logical groupings on top of the main menu. So here we want to do something related to a customer. We go to Customers, Transactions, Customer Tax Invoices. You'll see a list of all your previous process tax invoices in this grid. Choose Add Tax Invoices and over here you'll see the main body of your invoice. Choose your customer. If you don't have one, you can add one on the fly here by choosing Add New Customer. But we'll invoice Morning View Bicycles. Enter the information in the fields that are relevant to you. You don't have to complete every field. Invoice date and customer reference are usually important. You then go to the body of the invoice and you can choose which item you want to invoice. I'll select a time trial helmet. The program then automatically fills out all the information for you. You can work inclusive or exclusive of that. We'll work exclusively. The program automatically totals the lines on the invoice. If you want to add a quick note, you can. That note will appear on the invoice when it's printed. When you're finished, you can say save or email. It's the same as saving and it'll email the invoice as well. You can even view a print preview option as well. I'm going to choose save. And what that does is it updates the customer's account with the amount of the invoice. It takes the units out of inventory or stock and it also updates your general ledger accounts in the trial balance. It will also update the sale to appear in your final profit and loss. Your VAT is also updated for your VAT reports if VAT is relevant to your business. Thank you for joining us. In our next video, I'll show you how to capture supply invoices. For more videos, visit our YouTube channel or our website.